welcome back in this video we shall see what is a derivative most of us have studied about the derivatives but only a few of us know actually what is derivative so let's say we have a function f of x defined in this manner so this is the x-axis and this is the y-axis so the f this is the graph of function f of x so let's say we have a point x naught on x-axis the value of function at point x naught will be f of x naught which will be y of no y naught so the value of function at point x naught will be f of x naught so derivative is defined at the point x naught as the slope of tangent line at point x naught at point x naught so let's say we have this point this is the point a so the derivative which corresponds to x naught at x axis so derivative at point x naught will be the slope slope of function uh, the slope of tangent at point x naught so i repeat the derivative at point x naught will be the slope of tangent line at point x naught so for calculating the slope of tangent line we need at least two points in this case we have only one point which is x naught so to calculate the slope of this line we have to calcul calculate the slope between two points a and b so this red color red line is the tangent line at point x naught and this green line is the line the secant line between points a and b the secant line is defined as the slope between points a and b or the rate of change between points a and b so we will calculate the slope of secant line as the point b approaches a so the dis dif distance between point a and b becomes very small or zero so when the distance between a and b becomes very small the secant line will approach the tangent line or the slope of secant line will approach the slope of tangent line so i repeat for calculating the slope of tangent line we have we need at least two points in this case we have only one point which is x naught so to calculate the slope of a line of any line we need at least two points so we draw a secant line and calculate its slope in such a way that point b approaches point a and the dis distance between point a and b becomes very small or zero so here we have a point a which is defined as x naught y naught or x naught f of x naught we have another point b which is defined by which is defined as x1 y1 so to uh, we can write x1 as x0 plus delta x because we uh, we uh, have to keep the distance between a and b very small so that the, the slope of secant line should approach the slope of tangent line so delta x is the distance between point a and b which is very small value so the point b will be given as x naught plus delta x 
so x not plus delta s x so this distance is delta x this distance is delta x so it will the point uh, the x point of b will be x not plus delta x and y point will be so uh, the y value will be or the value of function will be f of x not plus delta x so we can calculate the slope of this secant line which is give, given in green color so, so the slope of secant line is f of x not plus delta x minus f of x not so which is nothing but this distance which this is f of x not plus delta x minus f of x not this distance is f of x not plus delta x minus f of x not and delta x is this distance so we know that the slope is equal to tangent tangent theta which is perpendicular over base so this is perpendicular which is equal to f of x naught plus delta x minus f of x naught and the base is delta x so we calculate the slope which is equal to tangent theta as this so that the derivative will be the not will not be the slope of tangent line but will be the slope of uh, sorry the derivative will not be the slope of secant line but it will be the slope of tangent this tangent line which is given in red color so this is the slope of secant line to calculate the slope of tangent line we have to use this limit the delta x approaches to zero so this delta x becomes very small so this delta x becomes very small so the slope of secant line will approach the slope of tangent line so this is the derivative this is the definition of derivative which is so the derivative is defined as the slope of tangent line at point x naught or any point so the derivative of this graph f of x at point x naught will be the slope of tangent line at point x naught so that is the definition of derivative see you in the next video